triple threat brand. It's a serious brand here in, uh, in Wally and all of You know, we rock them all year round. I really like the town here, Portadour Bakery. This is a nice day for a train ride. So that's the Wellington. All is on the grind, bringing you people content. 10.30 in the morning and I'm out of here. Interesting. I've always wondered why they got a statue of Gandhi at the Wellington railway station. Pretty cool though. <laughs> Good morning people. Today I'm down here in at the Wellington railway station. Now today we're taking a trip, a train trip. I haven't been to the station in years. So this is my first time to the station in Wellington for a long, very long time. I think the last time I took a train out somewhere was like 15 years ago. But let's go. We're going to show you uh, what's happening in the railway station. Also, um, we will take a trip on the train, probably going out to Portidua, and we'll show you people um, what's happening out there, just for something different. You know, we like to switch up on this channel because we like to bring you places, uh, culture, and people. So people, places, and culture. So let's go, vamos, let's go. So this is the station here. Let me show you. Pretty empty right now. It's early in the morning. People are going to work. Today is a Thursday. And because I can, it's giving you guys content. Oh. So let's go. This is a station here in Wellington. For those people who are watching this from overseas, they used to live here. Taking you people down memory, memory lane. Let's go get a ticket. Hi guys. I'm looking for a ticket to go to Porirua. So we don't sell tickets anymore, you can use cash on board. What's that? You can use cash on board. You can't? Okay. Well, I just found something out today. You can't buy tickets to go on the train, but you can still pay cash on the train. I think they've got some new trains now from what I remember. Maybe I will ask this guy here. Excuse, sir. Is this the train that goes out to Purirua? Is, my okay, yeah. how long How long is the trip? Uh, to Porirua or all yeah. the way? To Porirua. About 20 minutes. 20 minutes. So 20, 20, 20 to 23 minutes, say that. Okay. You don't mind me filming you, right? No, what's a film? Oh, I, I do <laughs> vlogs. Oh, well, fair Yeah, that's all right. Fair. So you'll be a superstar. Oh, okay. What's well, your name, my man? What's it? What's your name? Oh, it's Nick. Hi, Nick. Well, uh, I'm Cos. Nice so you, this is Nick. He's going to be responsible for uh, driving this train. And uh, if we stuff up, Nick, I'm going to come look for you, Nick. <laughs> okay, my man. <laughs> well, Nick, I mean that. If the train, if anything goes wrong on the trip, Nick, I'm coming to see you. Nah, nah bro, it was a good sport. So 20 minutes, he said, to go from uh, the Wellington Railway Station to Porirua. So let's get on the train, people. There's the train. Ooh, nice and warm here. So I'm on the train now and I couldn't get a seat facing the front so I can show you the ride going that way but I will I'm sitting with my back towards the front train is going that way but I'm looking backwards if you know what I mean oh you know what I mean so there you go I'm looking back to the train Wellington railway station you can pay cash on this train too. So I didn't get a ticket. They said that um, they didn't sell tickets, but I can pay on the train cash. Still old school, so, which is good. Please follow the instructions of the onboard crew. Kia ora, and thank you for traveling with Metlink. So, right here at the railway station, right next to the rail, well, Right, right here next to the railway station is the stadium, 
Now that's a Sky, what's it called now? Sky Stadium. Used to be called a Westpac back in the day, but now it's Sky Stadium. Home of the Hurricanes and Phoenix, the football team. Hurricanes, the rugby team. This stadium here. So now we're facing our back to the front and we're looking backwards while the train's going forward. Okay. I'm going to put it over, brother. All good. It's good to see that you guys still do the old school fashion oh, way cash. Oh, exactly. Nice day out there as well, which is even further, even better. Yeah. Well, thank you, brother. Enjoy the day. Same to you. Okay, you. cheers. Wow, there you go. Tickets. Still the old school tickets. See? So that's the Wellington Harbour, as you can see. Nice day. Started off, I thought it was going to rain this morning, but actually, it's a nice day, and we're having a bit of an adventure today, guys. See, See on my left here, that's the Welly, Welly Harbour, Wellington Harbour, there. Hope you guys enjoying the train ride a um, bit of a scenery that's the thing about New Zealand very green but a very good environment look at that you know, people need to appreciate this environment I think a lot of people here don't realize that they're you know, they're living, they're staying here in one of the best real estate on the planet. God's own. Okay, a bit of uh, scenery there. Please make sure to take off on the platform car readers. By the way, this is 10 in the morning. I'm catching a train up to P-Town. Putting in work to bring you good content. So, here we go. Bit cloudy out there now. See how the weather just changes like that. This is what suburbia Wellington, New Zealand looks like here in Welly 04. Linden Station. We're in Linden Station. Very close now to P Town. Thanks, mate. Welcome, have a good one, eh? Okay. The man. We in Portadua right now, just arrived. And the trip took 20 minutes. And it was $3.50 just to get here from the city. So if you're thinking of catching the train. It's so this is Portadua Station. Oh, look at this pretty cool artwork. Hey, this is what's up. Look at that. 
pretty dope. So, I'm in P Town, um, city centre. Hey guys, you had a voice. This is the city centre. Say hello to the camera. Yeah, what's up? That's what's up. See, I think this guy's supposed to be at school, but <laughs> oh, okay. Hey. Yeah, any shout out guys? Um, shout out to my mom and dad and for that old guy who gave me a free snapper car. Uh, okay, thanks brothers. Uh, yeah. Yeah, right. Just taking a walk to the centre. There's the railway station where I just came from. There. And oh it's a nice day. In fact it's a lovely day. Good day to go out and vlog and give you guys some content. Yeah, today's vlog, I, I thought I'd show you guys B-Town. Got a train out here. And try something different. It's always good to look around your, your area, surrounding. Meet some new people. See some new things. Get some new experience. That's what the channel's all about. And thank you people for supporting the channel. Thank you for uh, subscribing. And I salute you people. Welcome to the fams, because I can. We're trying to build the channel up, bring out good content, and build a community up. Because this will eventually be a travel channel. Hope to get on a plane and go to places and show you people new places and new sites, culture and food, and all that kind of stuff. Um, what's this, the river here? And there's a center there in P-Town. So for you people that used to live here in P-Town, in Porirua, that are now watching this from overseas, I'm just showing you people some old memories for you guys to take in. And welcome to Porirua City, North City. 10.30 in the morning and I'm out here giving you guys some new scenery out here in Wellington. We're out here in Porirua, in North City Plaza. Okay, the thing about coming to the malls and stuff like that, it's a lot of music going on, which I can't show, can't put on my channel, otherwise you get strikes. But, well, it looks like any other mall. So yes, we are here in uh, Rio's, and the reason why we're going in here, we're going to see, there's the triple threat, that's where you get all the triple threat gears here at Rio's in P-Town just to show you so we're gonna take you for a look around the shop and show you what uh, gears this guy's got the triple threat brand is a serious brand here in, uh, in Wally and all over the country and soon to hit the world and you get it here in P-Town best place to be to get the triple threat gears I'm down here in Rio's in uh, P-Town in Portidua at the mall and look at these dope shorts triple threat is a serious label you know serious brandy in wellington so come down pick up some of your shorts look at this dope basketball tops over here in p-town so make sure you come down here see Bernard and the, and the crew come see my man frankie number seven how dope that is got the power shell Look at that. Got some really, really cool, cool stuff here. But look, not only that, got the hats. Oh wow. Got the hats. Got the bucket hats. Look at that. These guys think of everything. Bucket hats, the hats. Got tees. Oh, bro. Look at this. How dope is that? For you guys that's been around for a while, if you grew up in Wally back in back in the days, remember uh, Foot Locker tracks? Everybody had a Foot Locker uh, track pants back in the day. Well, the same guys that made those back in the day are now behind this. Look at this, that's dope, right? Look at that. This. So make sure you people, you can access these guys out in P-Town, you can come to P-Town, to Porirua, 
or otherwise I think you can also catch them online and I'm going to leave the link down below uh, where you can get the triple thread uh, gears I'll leave the link for their IG the Instagram so because I can and you're going to be seeing me rocking triple thread look I haven't got my triple thread stuff here and thank you big up Franks big up to my man Frank okay kids so you can come here and get uh, outfits for your for your kids really nice so I hope you guys enjoyed that and um, make sure you turn up to P-Town pull up if you ever want triple threat gears you know where to find it now Thank you. so yes people we just left the mall and got us up a little bag of goodies courtesy of um, Rio's courtesy of Triple Threat. Thank you, Frank. Hooked me up with some gears. And that's what's up. Pretty good. So this is, uh, we're walking down here in uh, the courtyard here out in P-Town. I don't know what this area is called. I'm sure you locals will know. But it's beautiful. It's a nice day. It turned out to be a nice day today. Yeah. Fashion of the Pacific shop here in P Town. Got all the lava lovers. You know, all the material our Pacific people love. But yes. So, I mean, for a lot of you people watching this are familiar with the area. You're probably watching this from Australia. I'm down here in P-Town giving you people a little looks, looksy into your old neighborhood. Wow, look at this. Look at these murals here. That is dope. Let's get close. Look at that. How good is this? Whoever did this artwork, I salute you, my man, or ladies. Wow, great artwork, right? Dope artwork here. And this is the city of Porredua. Um I thought I'd come out here today and um, just have a walk around and show you people the area this is very nice area very good you know some places exceed their reputation but when you come out here the people people are friendly a lot of good good places to go to this is dope yeah this is out in the courtyard in p-town a few people around a cafe nice oh yes look at this it's a pretty cool place the little goat okay now remember this um this place here used to have the markets i don't know if they still have the markets yeah out in this car park i used to come here back in the day on the markets like early Saturday mornings like 5 a.m. in the morning we just come here for great feeds and seafood and chop suey all the, all the island food and stuff like that raro salads and donut raro donuts you should get it all all over here in this car park here so I don't know if they still have that uh, markets I don't know but anyway this is P-Town and thank you for coming to P-Town Always stay in the boss lane. Just a quick video to show you people what's up out this way. Thank you. Peace out.